out of myself and I do it in little increments. So one thing that I do, I'll, I'll share this with you. One thing that I do, and I don't, I don't do this very often, is uh, I go surfing. So I live about uh, 30, 40 minutes away from the beach. And every now and then on a, on a Sunday morning, I'll pack up the surfboard and I'll go. And uh, for people who don't know me, I'm I'm petrified of surfing. Like I'm 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 cool in pools and stuff. I'm not I'm not I'm not extremely afraid of the water, but it's just the feeling of being out in the ocean and and just feeling the force of the waves is just uh, as well as just the idea of sharks, to be honest. So every now and then I'll go I'll go on the morning um, I'll go by myself. I know I know how to surf, and I'll just tell myself, okay, I'm going to uh, just go up to my knee and just watch the waves come for a little bit, and then I can go. Mm-hmm. And then I, I do that. And then instantly I'm, I think, okay, well, that's not going to happen. Let me paddle out to that to that to where the good waves are, and I'll just wait there and see what that looks like. And then once I'm there, I, I start having fun a little bit more. And I say that that's, that would be kind of my approach to dealing with fears. I, I set a small increment that I can handle. And, uh, I, you know, if I can make it there, great. If not, I set a smaller one, I go for it. And, uh, you know, of course it doesn't always work out that way. Um, but I'd say I, I try to, I try to do something scary, um, either in a way like surfing or in a way like, you know, reaching out and talking to someone, you know, or putting myself out there in a, in a different way, uh, or taking a risk. I try to do it fairly often. So I'd say it's, uh, you know, in little increments, um, and, uh, pretty often. Mm-hmm. Wonderful. So with with everything that you've done and experienced so far, what would you say has been the best advice that you've ever received? Hmm. Um, I don't know if I if I heard this from Jim Carrey, <laughs> but uh, I think he said, uh, and I believe he was talking about his father, uh, this was the context, was he said, you know, you can still fail at something that you hate. Uh, so go after what you love and, you know, if you fail at that, great, you know, that's awesome. You can try something else, but I would, I would say that that's it. You know, it's, I know it seems kind of like, you know, you have to get the, you have to look for the advice in that, mm-hmm. but I'd say it's just at its core is, you know, realize it, that failing at what you love to do is always better than, uh, failing at what you hate. So just go do what you love. So, Adam, again, thank you so much for taking the time to chat with me. I really appreciate it, uh, and I'm very excited for your book to come out. If the listeners would like to read some of your writing or potentially purchase the book when it's available, where is the best place they can go to do that? Hmm. Uh, Well, first of all, man, thank you uh, again so much for having me on. I I had a really good chat. Um, So, yeah, if you you want to check out the book – uh, check it out on Amazon. Uh, that's going to be the best place to find it. Um, I'd say around when you're listening to this, although a little afterwards, uh, it'll be coming out in, in bookstores. Okay. Wonderful. Well, thank you so much. Uh, I will put all of those in the show notes so people can click right through. Sounds fantastic, man. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you for listening to another episode of the Advance Your Hour podcast. If you like this episode, please go into iTunes and give us a five-star rating. And while you're there, hit the subscribe button so that every single time I release a new episode, it will go directly to you without even thinking about it. If you're interested in hearing older episodes, please go to AdvanceYourArt.com where you can find the catalog of everything I've done so far, as well as contact information and projects I'm working on. Thank you again, and have a great day.